Hey guys, it's Cam Kane, and welcome back to another episode of the Coaching Carousel Dynasty in NCAA football. So we're at the very end of the year of our second season as defense coordinator here at UConn, and I think it's a bit of disrespect. They give us Central Michigan in the Little Caesars Pizza Bowl. They're 9-4 on the year. I mean, that's pretty good, pretty good for a Central Michigan team with a C plus, B minus, C plus rating. But is it good enough for the 14th ranked team in the country? I don't I don't think so. I couldn't get in the Capital One Bowl, but number 20 Wisconsin does. Wow. Michigan State versus Florida in the Outback Bowl. See, I would have took an 8-4 Michigan State team. I would have taken that. Get us a little more exposure. Rose Bowl is number three versus number four. Clemson, Ohio State. Uh, Fiesta Bowl is number nine Cal versus number 11 Georgia. Texas A&M, Nebraska in the Sugar Bowl, seven and eight. Five and six, UNLV versus Oklahoma in the Orange Bowl. That should be a big game. Big prove your worth game for UNLV right there. And the BCS National Championship against the only two undefeated teams left in the country, Texas versus Florida State. Well, I, hopefully we go out here and prove that they should have gave us someone better. Hopefully we go out here and prove that and we just play our game and dominate, so. 58-yard touchdown, Kevin Minza. Let's fucking go. Let's show them why we deserved a better game. Let's go. They are going to run on first down. Quarterback keeper, he's got a lane. And he's going to get the first down. It's going to be another run up the middle. And he's going to break Kevin Jones' tackle and get the first down. It's going to be a quarterback keeper. Omar Fort can't get there. Robinson's going to have a weird tackle on David Moore. They are going to pass here on second down. But we're going to get the sack. Let's go. Not much of anything downfield. And now it's going to be a big third and 12. Caleb Thomas, our other defensive tackle, finally getting a sack. I read the out route, and it's dropped. Oh, I read it the whole way, and Tyler Coyle drops the pick. And after, right after I say that, they, nope, I thought they were going to slow down, but they don't. Another touchdown. Let's go, boys. Come on. And they go back to the run here. Quarterback keeper. Tyler Coyle's going to miss. So is Keyshawn Paul. And we tripped down David Moore after a 14-yard rush. I went for two hit sticks and completely missed both of them. Not good at all. It's going to be another quarterback keeper. And, oh, my God, I got to switch the adjustments. I'm going to call timeout just so I can. It is going to be a pass here. Oh, no one's guarding the tight end. Robinson's going to bring him down, but not until after a big 29-yard reception. So they pick up the blitz pretty well, and they get an 8-yard reception off of it. It's going to be a run up the middle. And he's going to break a tackle, break two tackles, and get a first down. Kobe Lewis putting in some work. It's going to be a run up the middle to Kobe Lewis, and he's going to get brought down. Oh, shit, they're going to pass. Oh, he's got the quarterback's going to take off. It's a designed quarterback draw, and it's not going to work because we bring the blitz up the middle, and it's going to be a third and goal on the two-yard line. Are they going to pass now? No, they are going to run, and they're not going to get it. Denied. What a big goal line stand. 28-yard pass and then a two-yard pass for a touchdown. So it is 21-3 already. What a game it has been so far. And they got the running back out wide, Kobe Lewis, and he is going to get a first down. Who is guarding him? Going to be a play-action pass right here. Off his back foot's going to get it to the tight end, who's going to get brought down after a gain of four. It's going to be a pass here on second and six. He does have a man over the top, Pimpleton, and that's a touchdown. God damn it. Did our senior quarterback get hurt? No, he's back in the game right there, so he's only out for a couple plays, and he comes back in and throws a touchdown. It is 28 to 10. And they get, go screen play here to Lewis, and he's going to get tackled in the backfield. They're going to call a timeout. They want to try and get some points before they go into half to make it a respectable, respectable game. Off his back foot, he throws it deep, and he <laughs> makes the catch. You have got to be kidding me. Oh, my God. They are going to pass here, but it's not going to work. And Omar Fort is not going to get the sack. You have got to be kidding me. But we do end up getting the sack. 
He's going to try and take off, and he is going to get by everybody right here. David Moore, and he's going to get the first down. They're going to call a timeout. So with the... Uh, oh, my God. Anything goes when it comes to old niggas. Pippin' ain't easy. Pippin' ain't easy. Come on, Pippin' ain't easy. Jeremy Lucien was right there, and I tried to read it. And it made him take that angle even when I switched to him. And I wasn't even moving the analog. I don't understand. Wouldn't be surprised if they go back to the run sometime here soon. Because it was working for him at the very beginning. But they're not going to. And Omar Fort gets a sack. Let's go. And they are going to draw a play. And Kevin Jones. But no, it's going to be Johnson who's going to get him. Bring him down. He throws off his back foot. And that's picked off by Herring Wilson. He's going to break a tackle too. Can he take it? No, he can't, but he gets it down to the six-yard line. Herring Wilson with another interception on the year. And it's a touchdown pass to Kevin Minza. What a game so far from the seniors. And they do have a man over the top. It's Nixon, and that's going to be a touchdown. How are we getting beat deep? Come on now. And for once, it's our offense bailing us out. Holy shit. Is going to be a run through Kobe Lewis, and he is going to get brought down. For no gain on the play. They are going to pass here. And Omar Fort's going to get the sack. Let's go. And it's going to be a draw play on third and 16. And Kevin Jones and Tyler Coyle is there to meet him in the backfield. Let's go, boys. And our offense is right back to it. Oh, my God. They score another touchdown. Holy shit. 49-24. Dylan Harris with the sack. Let's go. Omar Fort is putting in work on this right tackle right now. They have a man over the middle. Ah! I had to leave that area because that tight end down the middle would have been wide open if I didn't follow him with Kevin Jones. Omar Fort is there again for another sack. Let's go. It's going to be a screenplay. Kind of read it late with Omar Fort. We're not going to get there. They're going to get a gain of six on the play. And they have a man over the middle, Pimpleton. He's going to break two tackles and get a first down. 23-yard reception, Khalil Pimpleton. is going to be a pass right here. And he's going to get brought down in the backfield by Pierce Devon. Omar Fort getting off that right tackle again. And Travis Jones is there to get the sack. It's going to be the out route, and they are going to get it, but it's not going to be a first down. And he's going to throw off his back foot and get the first down. You've got to be kidding me. Bernard Raymond with another first down. And we're there to get him in the backfield. We read the run on first down, and we're there to shut it down. Moore's got a man. No, he doesn't. Turner. Oh, almost picked off. He is going to take off and take a hit from Devon. And he is going to get a gain of one on the play, but not much of anything. So we're going to... No, they're not. They're going to do a screen pass. He's got some room. And take a big hit. Oh, my goodness. Takes a big hit. And that's turnover on downs. And our offense hopefully can run out this clock. And, oh, look at Kevin Minza putting the work in on his last drive of his career. Kevin Minza seals the deal. They pick up the head coach as we win the bowl game. I think we proved we should have been in a better one right there. What a game. You know, we gave up some deep balls over the top, but it didn't matter. Our offense was on the A game today. This Central Michigan team just has, has, was no match at all for us. And we are Chick-fil-A Pizza Bowl. Chick-fil-A. Little Caesars Pizza Bowl champions. What am I thinking? This is what happens after you work a 10-hour shift in the cold and then come play some games. Kevin Minza on his final games. 174 yards. Three touchdowns. Let's go, boys. What a year it has been. So happy. Great ending to the year. Should only get more interesting this offseason. Have to wait for the next episode for that. So we have a new school record for passing yards in a season. 3,698 from our quarterback. 
Omar Fort sets the school record for sacks in a season at 22, beating the old record by nine. National championship game. It's another nail biter. Back to back years, but Florida State takes down Texas in the national championship game. So let's see. Oh, Texas had an early 17 nothing lead. It was 17 17 7 going in the half. Texas with the lead. FSU scored. And then Texas scored. So they were damn. FSU was down down 10. With 12 minutes left, they come back, score two touchdowns in the final nine minutes to win the game. What a season it has been. We advance on to the end of the season, but that'll be for next episode as it's advancing. I will save that for the next episode. There it is. We all talked it over, Coach. We could not be more excited with what you've done here. Please stay for at least another contract. So, we have, we are left with this big, big, big decision. And I'm going to save that for the next episode. I'm about to do it right now. But, we're going to save it for the next episode for you guys. But, if you want to figure out what's going to happen this offseason, come back and watch the video next time. But, like always, like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching.